Hi, I'm Belinda. I'm the CEO and founder of Bell Deluxe. We are a made in Uganda sleepwear brand for urban women. I learned about the launch pad program in 2018. By then I was in university in my final year. And uh, one afternoon we were having our lecture and the team from Startup came. They introduced them and they asked us to sign up and be able to attend the classes over the weekend on Saturday, to be exact. And that's how I learned about it and I decided to take part. The reason I did was because their programs were exciting and uh, what they were going to teach us was, you know, very beneficial, very exciting at the time. And I felt like it was different from what I was studying from at school. I was doing a bachelor's in procurement and logistics and being able to enter into the world of entrepreneurship, ideation, business planning and things like that felt exciting and different and that's why I signed up. What made me want to participate in the Launchpad program was uh, one, the lecturers that were handling this were really giving us a whole different perspective to how business is done, you know, something like a glimpse of what would happen after a glimpse of what would happen after university. And uh, with that, honestly, I was sold, you know, from the classes that were very interactive to the team, to the people that were part of, you know, building these small little dream businesses and the activities we took part in. Um, I remember one time we were given a task to create a business one afternoon and and see the business that's most profitable the one that would make the most money that afternoon was, was the one that would win and my team my group decided would sell ice cream on behalf of the guy who was selling ice cream at the uh, university canteen and we made 150,000 Ugandan shillings in one afternoon and uh, with those lessons of teamwork um, greed finding opportunities in places that people wouldn't normally find opportunities. Those are the lessons I was able to pick on and excitingly just keep doing the program until we finally graduated. At the time of joining, I had no business. We were still in university, of course, and uh, we were still figuring out what would be next after our bachelor's degree. So I had no business, but I had a couple of ideas for sure. I thought I would come up with a television show about, you know, equipping youth with entrepreneurship skills. That didn't go a long way. Eventually, I ended up in employment, and after employment, I ended up in, you know, self-employment now. But the lessons I picked on during my, my, my classes at StartHub have been very vital from the beginning. I've been able to come up with the business plan, come up with, you know, things around ideation, customer relations, um, prototyping. There's just so much we learned back, back in school during the Launchpad program that I've been able to implement and get the business to this place. So I'm really grateful for that. The Launchpad program helped me in improve my idea by putting me out there. Initially, I was Scared, you know, how do I go in front of people and tell them I want to do, I want to do X, Y, and Z? But with the program, we're given different tasks, tasks that are actually physical and required you to go out in the market, do research, speak to customers, prospects, and just learn just about everything there is before you even start a business. I feel those lessons I've been able to carry on up to now, and I still implement those things whenever I'm trying to find out what new product to launch, what campaign we can run. I'm able to reach out to customers and ask them all these things. But also, uh, the program really taught us how to focus on what matters the most in the business. Making sales, once you've ticked that off, creating great products, but also creating a, building a brand that's beyond, you know, a product, a logo, and all those things. I was able to learn during the tutorials and I feel those are lessons I've been able to use now and I still use and it was really beneficial for me. The key things I learned that helped me push my business idea or things around prototyping and creating great products, listening to customer feedback, um, understanding market trends, doing a lot of research but not getting stuck at the research phase 
awkward to actually now really step out and you know implement everything i've picked up along the way those are things that i've found very valuable and i still practice and they've enabled us they've enabled me and the business to be able to grow to this place now well the program helped me change my perspective about entrepreneurship by teaching me what really worked and what didn't also taught me uh, the importance of doing research putting myself out there and knowing there's no bad idea honestly you just have to see if it works and, and and just keep going if it works great if it doesn't pick up the lessons and move on to the next thing and i feel those are really important lessons you know as an entrepreneur but also the beauty about this is we are now part of you know a community of, of other people that went through the same training and each one of them has either joined uh, entrepreneurship or they are into business but the values and the things we are taught are still vivid you can see that someone who has been through business training works a bit different from someone who hasn't we are more out there we are more outspoken ambitious which is not bad because I feel ambition is really important if you want to grow in the journey of business as a, or as a career person but yeah they taught us how to be ambitious how to pursue our dreams how to test out whatever we want to do an experiment and learn the lessons and keep moving so those were really vital lessons okay so currently we are at our physical location those are some of the milestones we've had as a business I started this business in 2020 during the lockdown and um, it was because I wasn't having good quality sleep when I did enough research around sleep and what felt comfortable to wear I discovered I needed something that was lightweight breathable and comfortable and uh, the only way around it was to create a product that would fit into that, that bracket so I figured fashion would be my means and yeah without a background in fashion you know as an entrepreneur once you've learned the basics honestly you can do just about anything and with the backup of the knowledge I'd learned during my course at uh, startup I was able to just you know do excessive research like plan the entire business out even before I started and once the lockdown was eased I went out got together a team got together the raw materials we needed to start and I did and one of my first clients is actually one of the founders of startup and uh, it was really nice to tell her this is my new adventure and she supported me bought our first product and from then on we were able to spiral and make more products and grow it's been a journey of a lot of grit and hard work but every lesson every decision has mattered and has enabled me and the business to grow to this place i am proud of where we are now we now have our first physical store at motive we also sell our products online on our website all those are huge milestones for any kind of business any small business in Africa I would actually be happy to have a flagship store and an online presence like a website but I also sell our products on social media those are huge milestones for us I've also been able to take part in a lot of fellowships that uh, are attributed to being part of a business like recently I've been part of the DHL Go Trade Fellowship that is straight across borders I did that for an entire year I was also part of several other trainings under Zimba Women and a motive as well and it's been those little things that came with you know being part of the entrepreneurship ecosystem that have been able to benefit from from these kinds of opportunities my advice to young entrepreneurs out there is stay focused work really hard and put yourself out there for every opportunity that you see there is no idea that's bad you just have to test it and see if it works if it works great push it to the maximum and if it doesn't pick up the lessons and move on to the next big thing there's no shame in failing it's only the lessons that you pick on and carry on that really make you the differentiator from you know the majority that's how you stand out so just pursue your dreams and uh, for sure I would recommend everybody take part in the launchpad program it's something completely different from what they're teaching you in school as a university graduate 
or someone aspiring to complete their university education, you're going to gain the skills you'll need to be able to face the world outside here. You'll need skills in creative thinking, prototyping, ideation, market research, and I don't think the education system currently caters for that. So when you have an opportunity to take part in a launchpad program like Start Hub, grab it and tell your friends to take part too.